Strut, Kun Yin. Welcome. We're going to get going on our stop punch today. Stop punch is a great technique to use with your self-defense. You're going to use it in the body. We're going to use, in fact, for us, for what we do is a stop punch to the shoulder with our green glue technique. So I'm going to show you how to do that. I want you to make sure once again that you are having your hand be nice and tight and powerful when you make contact with your target. If it's loose, it will hurt and you'll feel a pain in your joints. Okay, this is a knife hand technique. So I want for your hand to be, you're gonna be striking right here on the meaty flesh of the hand. Your fingers are gonna be tight and tight together. The thumb is gonna be tucked. As you strike with any knife hand, you wanna make sure you're hitting in that area, okay? So as you do that, um, I want for your body to go with it so you get more power. So I don't want your hand way out there as you strike. I mean, you can do that. You just get less power the farther you get from your hip. So as you strike, this is relatively in close distance. Okay, I'm gonna strike here, I'm gonna drive in. We do this to make the arm numb. So if you strike right here, there's two pressure points that are right in here. And if you feel on the front side of the shoulder, and you feel it on your shoulder, there's a little indentation where this muscle wraps over the top and then there's muscle underneath it. So this muscle right here, in between those two is where your pressure point is and where we wanna attack. So if I'm striking, I'm gonna strike right in here. So I'm gonna pull my opposite hand back and I'm gonna drive through with my hip and my knife hand. Okay, so I'm striking here. So as I go through, I wanna make sure I get that strike, okay? So we're gonna get a chance to practice that nice and strong. So you're just gonna hit through here. Hey! Hey! Now as you strike, you really wanna hit in this area. Make sure that you're not up high, because people tend to do that. And that knife hand fits nicely right in there, so there's a little bit of a curve there, okay? Here we go, let's do five on each side. Ready? Here we go. Hana! Do! Set! Net! Gossip! Okay, switching sides, other side, same thing. This one takes a lot of practice at home, making sure you're accurate. So as you're working on your targets, if you have a hand target, that's great. If you have a bob, that's even better. Uh, you really wanna make sure that you're practicing going and striking exactly where you think you're striking. Um, so get some sort of way to evaluate that. And putting a piece of tape on a target or something like that's really helpful. So you wanna make sure you're accurate because you don't wanna be striking and strike in the wrong place because it won't have the impact. There's a lot more muscle tissue you know, across the chest. Here we go. Once again, tight hands, tight thumb, striking into that palm, pulling the opposite hand back so you're getting that strike. Hana, two, set, net, toss it. Okay, you wanna snap that in, you're gonna pop it in and pull it back. Let's try that again right here in front of me. So we're gonna go pop and pull it back. Now you're not getting a chance to practice your accuracy because you're not on a target and you're just in the air. It's a little bit harder to make that effective. Seems like it's a lot easier, but you don't get the resistance and no one's tracking your accuracy. So it's, it's harder in the long run because it's harder to be successful down the road. Okay, here we go. Ready? Hut! 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 Switching sides. Ready? Hut! So you'll notice part of the time I wasn't pulling that hand, opposite hand back as fast, and you can tell. So really work as you're doing it, pulling that hand back so that motion is a lot faster going in. We want that equal and opposite power. Okay, you're doing great. Please practice this 20 times on each side each day for two weeks. Then I want you to hashtag did it with your name and the date down below. Please keep being awesome. If you have questions and comments, please ask me that as well. Looking forward to hearing from you. Cheerio! Konyan!